Hi everyone, welcome back to Class Notes. On this channel, I'll be posting fun tech tutorials each week, so be sure to subscribe and turn on your notifications to so receive updates for these videos. Today, we'll be creating free virtual gift ideas that you can use for birthdays, graduations, and other events. I'll be using a Bitmoji in place of photographs. This is a really fun alternative that you can use, especially if you don't have many photos of the person that you're sending the gift to. For this method, you do need to have the Bitmoji Chrome extension, which is on the top right corner here, and I'll have a link to that in the description box below. Let's get started. We'll be using Canva and we'll be using the video dimensions here, which is 1920 by 1080 pixels. This just gives us full HD quality. We'll be creating three e-gift ideas or virtual gift ideas. And the first of it is just a static e-card. A really good idea to use a template. So we'll just be using, let's do a birthday template. And this is really nice because it gives you a couple of ideas on how to get started. So if you want to have fun facts, hobbies or milestones, we'll be using that later. It just gives us a nice layout to begin. So I'm just going to start out by deleting any of the elements that I'm not going to be using. Those are also paid elements, so I'm not interested in paying at the moment. So I'll just delete those ones. Let's write happy birthday. And I'll leave that as it is. Let's add in our Bitmoji. And let's have one with a, a puppy. Okay, not that one. To do this properly, you do need to right click, um, press copy image, and then control V to paste it into there, just move something. So give me one moment, there we go. And that gives you your Bitmoji on your page. Okay, so then you can have some elements. I would just go for birthday elements, grab some banners and decorations and put them in a nice spot. Control C to copy these ones and just, just going to go all along the top here and that's fine with me and let's have just a birthday cake and there we go a little popper over here okay that's fine with me so we'll go ahead and download that e-card download png suggested so png it is it's just an image and it's very good quality we'll go ahead and view that as well just to make sure everything's okay there and it looks good to me all right the next idea is to create a gif so instead of having all these static images we're going to choose stickers that move around a little and that just makes it a little bit more interesting so we're just going to type in birthday stickers we're going to delete these ones and replace them with more interesting ones. So it's just kind of makes it more fun, I think. A little gift as well. And see, is there anything else that we want to have inside here? Let's do a cake. Put it here okay and then now we're ready to download and when you do download the recommended is video but you can also go for a gif which is a short animated clip and it just replays on loop which is quite fun as well so let's download this one and take a look at the final product Okay, so there it is. You can show you like this as well. That looks pretty good to me. And the final idea is to do a video. The video is quite simple. You just need to animate the slides and add a couple more pages. So let's animate this slide first of all. It's just on the top right corner here. Let's do a tumble. And that just comes in real nice as well. Then we can add a couple more pages. So let's do add new page. And using the same template, 
let's go for the milestones and edit the milestones as well. Delete anything we don't want to have. Okay, add any bitmojis. So I would have a bitmoji or a picture for each of the different milestones. So for childhood, these two are quite good. I think I just used the keyword child there. This one, maybe. Oh, it's appeared for a second. Let's go for primary school for that one. And childhood for this one. And for high school, we can use a different one. Okay, maybe some books. Okay, and then obviously you can have a couple more stickers in there to make it more interesting, but I'm just gonna go ahead and anim animate those ones so that that's done. Let's add a new page, go for another template. I'm just gonna go for five pages and then just um, have the video play. So let's go for, Okay, so this is a video. If you have a video for the person you're sending the gift to, that's really nice. I'm just gonna say, have a wonderful birthday. I don't need any of these elements here. So I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of those. Um, and for the video, I'm just gonna have a placeholder here. There are a couple of sample videos that Canva has. I'm just going to type in people and then find a fun one to play there. And you can see that um, this video is quite long. It actually extended our time quite significantly. So what we're going to do is go for a trim. I'm just gonna cut, cut, cut. That's fine. All right, it's just a bit of a sample for us. You can preview what the um, video looks like so far. So let's go back to the top and preview these three pages that we've just created and see what that looks like. Okay, so it looks fine. I'm just gonna skip ahead a little bit. Okay, it's, it's looking good, okay. And I'm just going to have a couple more pages for this one. Um, I'm gonna go for a collage, so in elements, I'm going to insert a grid and then you can upload images for each of these spots so that you have a nice collage for um, the person you're sending the gift to. I don't really mind which one I go for here. And lastly, just animate that. I think that's quite fun to do. Block is only for text, I think, so I don't have any text here. And then last page, let's just go for a really general one where we're just wishing the person happy birthday. Anything I want to do with this? I think I'll just have a fun birthday bitmoji at the end, just to tie everything together. Let's go for a cake one. And lastly, just animate that. Okay, so that looks quite nice there. So now we've got five pages and we are we're at 26 seconds lastly i would go for some music yeah it's definitely the one okay and then we're finished okay so let's preview that The video looks quite nice. Yeah, it's pretty.
pretty much finished. So we can then go ahead and download that as a video. You can download all the pages, which is what I recommend, or you can just do a section of that. And then you're finished. Thank you for watching this video. I hope that you got some ideas on what to include in your virtual gift. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to Class Notes for more videos like this in the future. Until next week, see you later and have a good day. Bye.